welcome once again to ELT Tops. My name is Alejandra and he is Leonardo. This time we are going to talk about top 5 useful strategies for children to learn English at home. strategies for example to make it natural like the language at home okay but sometimes it's not easy when both parents don't speak English I mean only one and sometimes I have seen that kind of experiences and children just learn the language slowly but they can learn both at the same time okay and try to I don't know just use it as, as the language at home and they will be like used to hearing the language and then to speak it. Alright, well, um, this is my personal opinion. Probably you will collect many different opinions. But what I think is that they should be constantly exposed to the language in an informal way. So that would be, in my opinion, Exposure, a lot of exposure to the language, yeah? and very, very informal practice with them. Okay, I think I'm going to tell you my experience, to tell you about my experience with my own children. Uh, I used to, to, to read uh, for them in English. I used to read books every single night. At first, it was very easy books, books with an illustration and a word. And then, as, as they were uh, growing up, well, the, the, the content of the book uh, increased, the number of words, sentences, paragraphs. Well, I think it, it, is, it was successful. Both of my children speak English fluently. Celebrate family birthdays and festivals. Making birthday cards is a fun activity. Birthdays and family festivals are good occasions to give small shows and to play with family and friends who also speak English. English corner or English table. You can set up an area of the house that provides a focus of anything related to English sessions. Games, a mini library of picture books, displays of English culture such as pictures or flags, displays of drawings, homemade books or craft work. Reading aloud. Practice reading the picture book aloud and decide how are you going to bring the story to life. Introduce some of the new words before reading the book and be prepared to whisper translations for difficult words until your child gets used to them. Rhymes and songs. A fun way to pick up words in English is the repetition of rhymes and songs. So you can put together a playlist with songs that can be played over and over again for your child to become familiar with certain vocabulary. Picture book time. This method can open a whole new world to young children learning English. Choosing the right books can be tricky, but it is important to understand the benefits of having this one-to-one -one interaction with your child. 